Hey guys, welcome back. It's Sub-Zero and we're going to play more of my survival Minecraft, baby. We just left uh, an abandoned mine shaft on the last video and came back home and fed our cows and we breeded some more. So we got a couple more calves out there and we fixed the garden. So we have a couple of... Oh, now they're growing up. All right. So that was pretty fast. So in order to farm effectively, we're going to go ahead and kill a couple cows. We're going to kill this guy. Mm -hmm. We're going to steal his meat, and then we'll just feed them hay and get them happy. There we go. I wanted them to breed. Yay, got another one. All right, so we got another baby, and I'm happy with that for now. Dude, our carrots are, all that stuff is like ready to go, too. We have enough for now, but I want to get, let's just, might as well just harvest it all. And just keep the, hey, a melon! I didn't even notice that that actually grew finally. It took forever, it seems like, too. So let's grab our seeds and let's replant everything. And we're gonna go like this. Hey, a sheep. Should we try to keep him? Maybe if I put another fence right here. Let's do that. Let's build another fence and we can have a sheep farm. We'll take that and we'll take that. And we can just make a bunch of fences. Maybe not a lot of fences, but I think it'll be enough. And I think I have one more, yep, one more here. And I believe we have one more, three more fences here. So they're going to be multicolored, but at least it'll work. I don't care. At this point, I just want to get... I think it'd be nice to have another fence and get some sheep. And I need more fence. So we're going to go ahead and just get rid of this. We're going to chop down the fence that I built here originally, which I did that just to have a nice look to it. But at this point, I just want freaking animals, brother. Stay! You stupid bitch. Okay, let's do this smart. I just don't want them to be able to get out like the cows did that one time. So we'll get rid of all this crap. Fuck, dude, are you kidding me? I'll just do it the cheap way down there. Now they can't get out, right? Stay! All right, we need to get a gate. So we'll do this the right way. And since we're here, we might as well just make more fences too. So we got a gate and we also got more fences so I could put those up. So we can do this the correct way. So we got plenty of room for our cows. I just don't want, you know, I like to be a nice guy, you know, and have a nice, you know, plenty of room for my animals to free range, bro. There we go. Now I don't have to worry about them getting out. Actually, I can do this the real correct way. Hey, fella, come here. There we go. Now I feel that's a little more efficient. Now, I'm going to go see if I can get this sheep that I keep seeing over here, too. Now, where'd that sheep go? See? I always say this, man. Whenever you are not looking for a sheep or looking for an animal or whatever, they're, they're just there. And as soon as you go to get one, it's like the game senses that and it just says, goodbye. Yeah, dude, that sheep disappeared. He was literally right there. Unbelievable. Unfucking believable Oh, there he is. Hey. Dum dum, come here. Yeah, come follow me, dude. Hey, you, you come too. Yeah, come on. Ha! Perfect. And now they made a black sheep. <laughs> I love it. And with the sheep, it's funny. Like, they could be gray, white, black. I don't know what other colors. I think there's kind of like a brownish color one. But they can just randomly generate whatever sheep, you know, it doesn't. It's not like race oriented, I guess. It's just actually pretty, pretty liberal for this game. It's pretty nice. But anyways, they'll mate and make more sheep. So we will have, and we'll get meat out of them when we kill them. And same with these guys. Mate again. Yeah, baby. So there we go. And look, our crops are already growing again, dude. So we are farming like mothers in here, dude. All right, so I'm going to take a little trip. 
So let's jump in our little bizoat. Let's go this way and see if we can find anything. Because I'm pretty sure there's another village over here, and I had seen it. And I always intended to come back to it. Yeah, there is a village, okay. Because we had gone over here many videos ago, and I could have sworn there was a freaking village. Alright, let's go ahead and pillage this village. And get some crap. It'd be nice to get some pigs, too, eventually. Alright, hey, a kitty cat. I don't have any fish, though. Grab that bed. Sorry, I stole your bed, fella. Pillaging. A villaging. Yeah, these guys got no chests in there, man. Aha. Dude. Two diamonds. I almost feel bad. Hey, a nice helmet, too. What kind of helmet do I have now? Oh, I have a diamond helmet. I feel like we're just being jerks, stealing their crap. But isn't that what pillaging a village is all about? Stealing crap, you know? That's what pillaging is. All right, so we got some decent stuff from there. I say we just skedaddle. Dude, I didn't know you could go so deep in here. Some of these swampy areas like this? I never even thought about going back like this. Why didn't I do this before? We just like gave up that one time and just started going towards the ocean. Let's just go this way and see where we get. We got a bed with us, we got food. We got everything we need. Let's get out right here. All right, now that's gotta be the same village we just pillaged, dude. Because we just came from that way over there on the water. If it is, I'm going to feel like a real dummy. I think it is. <laughs> it's the same goddamn village. It is, because there's the door. Oh, for the love of Christ. Okay, so we came from that way. So let's just, for fun, we'll trek this way a little bit, just for the hell of it. Just see if we see anything over the horizon. If not, then we'll just head back. What is that? Is that just a tree? It's like something right there. We're going to trek a little bit over that way. Just to see if we see anything else. Just for fun. Why not? Can't hurt nothing, right? Oh, it looks like that's just a tree. It just kind of looked like a, a big building or something from back here. But, since we're already this far, might as well just trek a little bit more. See if we can see anything fun. This is one of my favorite things to do in Minecraft, though. Just explore shit, dude. Hey, a big old crevice. Is there anything fun over here? We find a wolf or anything? Crap, I left my bones back at the house. I come across a wolf, we could have got one. Cody's big on that. We have two wolves in our other game now. I'll link me and Cody's survival. Hey, a beehive. Now, I found this in one of the videos. I think I showed you guys. Yeah, they're beehives. As long as you don't disturb them, they won't hurt you. Check it out. They're pollinating. <laughs> There's the beehive, and they got the bees. They pollinate, see? It's so cool, dude. They just added that to Minecraft in the last, I don't know, a couple months. Adding stuff to the game keeps people interested. And Hey, dude, there is a village over there. Right bloody there. See, I had a feeling if we just went a little bit further, I was just thinking there'd be something. I was hoping there'd be like a big cave type thing, like one of those big crevices with the lava down below where we could, you know, possibly dig for diamond, but I'll take this. Look, another beehive. Dude, they're spawning everywhere. I love it. This doesn't look like a really big village either. Thank God. Oh, it's abandoned too. Oh, crap. I didn't see him. And you don't have anything good. And you don't have any chests. And you're a butt cheek. I don't think I'd want to eat food from a zombie village. Hey, a chest. Let's make sure there's no zombies around here. Ass. Ah, nice, dude. I will take it all. Oh, look, he's stuck. Ha ha. Dum dum. Hey, horses. I don't have a horse saddle, though. I think I... See, I, I'm getting my games mixed up. If I'm playing the one that me and Cody have, I think we have a horse saddle. Die, bitch. Alright, well, that was fun. Do I have a horse saddle, or is it just this horse, horse armor? Now, what does that do? If I put that on the horse, he'll be protected, but will he let me take him? Hey, the horse likes me. So what does that mean? I can ride him? Oh, I see. There. See, the horse can like me, but I have no way to ride him. 
So we're going to go ahead and take our... Oh, i got to put the saddle. So I'd have to have a saddle to do this. All right. Well, we'll come back another time then. Actually, since we know where this village is, it's not that far from our house. I will keep that in mind so we can always come back and come get that horse. How do we get on this side of the mountain? I just got turned around in that village, which happens all the time to me. I go pillage a village, I start getting turned around, and when I leave that village, I have no clue what way I came in at. We're probably going the long way, but I, like I said, I left that village and totally screwed myself up, man. Man, we're supposed to be in the, how do we get this far? I'm probably just gonna edit all this out and just speed up the footage of me trying to get back. Cause who wants to see all that, dude, really? We've spent the whole day just messing around already and we had to sleep already, dude. That's crazy. How I got so turned around, dude, I have no fucking clue. But that is just straight frustrating that that even happened. For the love of God, you just go to look for some village. There's that other village. All right, so the house should be like right. Yeah, here we go. Oh, hey, Mr. Llama, what's up? Still hanging out here, eh? Alrighty then. Alright guys, that's it for this video. I just wanted to get back home, man. Uh, anyways, we found a couple new villages. I knew that was kind of the, the, the goal, was to try to just explore a little bit. I was hoping to find a better cave to go dig down in, but we found two villages instead. Whatever, I'm happy with that. But getting lost on the way home, like for the love of God, this game is so easy to get lost in because it's so gigantic and so massive that you trek away from home just a little bit. If you don't know your direction, you're done, man. You're gonna have to start a whole new life unless you know your position. That position number that's up on the left-hand side there, you can have that off or on. I keep it on because I know that my number is around this numbers right here, like 654. Whenever I start getting like a negative 1,000 and stuff like that, I know that I'm far away. So anyways, if you like our stuff, hit subscribe, hit that bell notification so you know when we upload a new video. And also, we've been streaming Minecraft on Sundays. We might be switching up the games a little bit. Um, but as far as um, streaming the games on Sundays, that's always going to happen around noon Central Time. Maybe 1 o'clock Central Time. We've been doing it for the last few weeks. We're going to continue to do it. But anyways, until next time, we'll see ya.